What were the hottest red carpet looks of the week? Well, we're going to find out from our super fabulous Holly Scoop panel. Let's start off with Scarlett Johansson. She's pregnant and she's out flaunting that body. I got to be honest, like she doesn't even look pregnant. What'd mm -hmm. you think? She hit it really well. I don't really like the makeup with the red, but I definitely think the outfit was really good for, you know, what's going on in there. What's in going on in the shirt? <laughs> yeah. Makeup guru, let's find out what you think about the makeup. Oh, I kind of agree with the makeup, and I, I think she does look gorgeous. She, she looks great, but I think everything, the hair, the makeup, even the outfit was a little aging for her. It was a little too mm -hmm. mature. Jessica, what do you think about Scarlett's look? Do you think she should show it off more skin? Yeah, it's Scarlett Johansson. You know, of course we want to see like, you know, that really curvy body of hers, but you know, maybe she's trying to cover it up because she is pregnant, but she had that really beautiful pregnancy glow, so I'll, I'll give her that. I agree with you. I mean, I, I'll give her that for getting out on that red carpet, because if I'm pregnant, I'm just going to be sleeping all day. Long. I don't want to sleep in the house. Emma Watson, Jay Mandel. Um, I feel like every time she's on the red carpet, she hits it. Although I feel like this might be a mature look from her, I do like her makeup. What do you think about her makeup? Oh, beautiful. Always natural and just really minimalist. She just always not it out of the park. Did you think she should have shown more skin? I feel like it was really demure. You know, I don't know. Someone like Scarlett Johansson, I would love to see more of her curves, but you know, it's Emma Watson. She doesn't really show like, you know, too much anyways, but I love the jumpsuit. I think it, you know, it looked really, really good on her. I loved her hair to the side. She just always like rocks that red carpet. So you have jumpsuits. Clearly I missed them that yeah. because all you girls are wearing yeah. jumpsuits. Yeah. Is, is jumpsuits uh -huh. the new way to go? I think so. I think it is. It's, it's really nice. I think it's super in and I, Emma Watson just always kills it for me. I love it. I love every little bit of it. Our next girl is Kim Kardashian. This is her street walk. Kardashian collection for Sears. Tiny, what did you think about her whole look? Um, really just conservative and nice. Nothing bad to say about it. Mm -hmm. Jessica? I think she looks good. Her body's looking really good. I own a few pieces from the uh, Kardashian collection at Sears. So I you do. like their I love it. I love their line. Oh, amazing. What do you think? I think it's really typical Kim Kardashian. I think she looks great in the way. I think it really fit her body perfectly. Of course, it's the Kardashian collection, mm -hmm. so it should. But yeah, I, again, there's nothing really bad to say about it. Now, it's interesting, that dress is $86, so if you guys want to look like Kim Gay, go to Sears. I want to talk about Shaylee Whitley. I feel like she's like the new it girl, move over Jennifer Lawrence. What do you think about this Ellie Saab dress? I'm always a huge fan of Ellie Saab, but this was not an it girl dress. It was way too mature for her. I could see it on an older actress. Um, I didn't think she looked bad, but I just didn't think she looked great. I actually agree with you. Yeah. I didn't think she looked bad, but... Yeah. Definitely made her look older. Yeah. What do you think? Um, I agree with both of you. When I saw this dress, I was hoping to see something more like, uh, just in fashion, a little mm -hmm. younger to match her. I mean, her being the new it girl, I mean, she could have really rocked it. And this one, I just think it was a miss. And she's got the body, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I just didn't like the print that much. And it was really dull. And I feel like with her hair color and her personality, she could have just... I don't know, not even made bright colors, but just not chosen those <laughs> colors. But again, like you said, maybe on an older actress it would have worked. All right, guys, you guys are some tough critics. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for giving me all the scoop on the red carpet looks of the week. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.